guys, Chris look! Smith. I am Chris Talt. And I am Sean Smith. And here are your morning announcements. Eastside Sub High School's mock trial team competed in the annual Suffolk County Bar Association mock trial tournament from February 2nd through March 23rd, finishing in the top four out of 30 schools. Let's go to Jack with more information about the team's success this year. That's right guys, the case was a criminal matter involving securities fraud. Students met with social studies teacher and mock trial coach Patsy Lester several days a week after school as well as Saturday mornings to prepare for the tournament. They also received professional coaching from attorney Brian Mitchell who has been working with the team alongside Lester for 22 years. The team took turns as both prosecution and defense going undefeated against St. Anthony's, Deer Park, Sachem, Newfield, St. John's, and John Glenn, before falling to Huntington by one point in the county semifinals. The semifinal round was argued in district court before Judge Eric Sox, who commended East Islip mastery of the case and their professionalism in the courtroom. Ms. Lesser said she is very proud of the way the team divided and worked together through a very tough competition. She said the team inspires her with their dedication and their team spirit. Mock trial team did very good. Yeah, it's really good for them. Uh, you know, especially to place top four out of 30 teams. Yeah, yeah that's a lot of schools. Yeah, it's good to see all their, uh, their hard work and dedication paying off. Yes, it is. Finally, April is here. And with that comes Autism Awareness Month. Autism Awareness Month aims to bring awareness to autism spectrum disorders and help people understand what ASD is and how it affects a growing number of people each and every day. The high school will be recognizing Autism Awareness Month starting on Monday, April 4th. The core program is making and selling bracelets for $5 and they will also be selling puzzle pieces for $1. There will be a table outside of the cafeteria every day in the and in the school store for the whole month of April. Please come and support our efforts to recognize autism awareness. Thank you. Junior Naomi Mackay has been nominated by the East Slice of Art Department for the Roberta Strett Memorial Award announced by the Huntington Camera Club or HCC. The winner will be announced on April 12th and awarded a grand prize of $500. Naomi's video presentation demonstrates her commitment to photography, as well as her relationship with the darkroom and how it impacted her. We had a chance to take out her video, and I really do think she can it win the award. It was a really great video. She has a bright future in photography, and I look forward to seeing more photos and videos that she can make. You know, you, you can check it out too. Please, go to the description down below and check out Naomi's video. And now, let's go to James with our weather. Thanks Chris, I'm James here with the weekend's weather report. Starting this weekend off, Friday, a typical beginning of April day, highs of 58, lows of 44. Moving in, we have an extremely sunny Saturday. You might need to grab a hat, block out some of that sun, it's been a while, beginning of April. You gotta get all the spring clothes out, it's that type of year, highs of 54, lows of 41. No clouds in the sky except a nice and sunny day. Moving into our Sunday fun day, highs of 53, lows of 40, typical Sunday type of day. You know, that's it for this weekend. Take care, brush your hair. Attention all seniors! Your class council is participating in the Spirit Week door decorating contest. All underclassmen are in it to win it. We need to win. Please print out a color photo of younger you, a present day photo, and a photo of what you like to be doing after high school. Bring all your photos to room 204 and place them in the envelopes in the door. Let's do this class 22. Let's win. Well that's all for this week East Islip. Be sure to like and subscribe to our channel. Turn on that bell to get notifications when new videos are posted. Be sure to follow us on Instagram as well at WFTK underscore studios. Remember, be smart, be safe, and always wear your student ID.